congrats to Juventus. Very difficult situation for us. We are in uh, a deep hole, like, like I said, it's that in locker room, so it's for us is perfect time now to to put finger to each other, know who is guilty. But I think that we will still uh, stay together and, and fight for sure. Very painful period. Uh, went to today. Start to play very aggressive in the third quarter. We didn't find the solution. We play without without sets, without screens, and defensively a few times uh, they score from from those offensive rebounds. And uh, you know, if you if you receive that point from five seconds until the end with that dunk, for sure you didn't deserve the win. The win. Komandos mašinos rungtynės, treneris visų pirma pasveikino važiavus su pergalėm. Treneris minėjo, kad dabar yra sunkus momentas, tačiau komanda vis tiek susivienijus ir kovoja. Taip pat treneris atsakė, kad vienos komanda pradėjo agresyviai žaisti trečiame rungtynių kelnyje, į ką pane važia komanda nerado būdų atsakyti. Toks buvo komentaras apie rungtynės. Coach, you lead by I think 14 points in fourth quarter, and what happened in the end? Like I said, we start play aggressive. We play without set. We start, we stop, execute our offense, and that's it. The same as Shrunkin Kelnia, Panevich, who played against Rolko, was a good player. The class was both as good as good. Well, the trainer said that, as the first one, we did not see the player playing aggressive. We did not see him playing with any other team. And the other team was playing with priority and aggressive. Laimėt šios rungtynės. What about Varnas? How do you say about him? Still is out of the team. I don't know. But he will not play the next three games for sure. Klausimas buvo apie Martyną Varną, kokia yra jo situacija, ką treneris sakė, kad kol kas niekas neraiško ir artimiausių metų jis dar nežais. As you see, all the game was in the last two possessions. So I think, you know, both team could win the game. I think that on the end, with this effort, that extra effort actually from all guys on the floor, maybe we deserve a little bit more so that we got this miss shot on the end. But in general, like I said, I think tough game, very physical game, no, maybe not the best basketball for everybody, but I think very exciting game that's for fans and for everybody else that were the, in the game. Congratulations to my guys. We come from one uh, depth that we have in the, in the second quarter, actually, the game was up and down, and then in the second quarter, when we had a leading three points, we, they had a 10-0 run, which determined the second quarter. But on the end, in the third quarter, uh, you know, we really put an extra effort defensively, first of all. And then when the defense works like that, of course, then in offense you find, you find your points. So I think, in general, good teamwork. Very important win for us against one of the best teams in the league. But this is just one win. Komentuodamas šios rungtynės, treneris sakė, kad tai buvo fantastinis mačas, kurio pabaiga lėmėsi realiai pastaruosiuose dviejose atakuose. Taip pat treneris pasveikino savo auklėtinės su šia pergalė, pasidžiaugė, kad po dobės antrajame kelinyje pavyko sugrįžti į žaidimą. Ypatingai treneris džiaugiasi trečio rungtynio kelinio pabaigą, kurio komandos auklėtiniai daug pastangų įdėjo tam, kad išlygintų rezultatą. Taip pat treneris minėjo, kad Letkabelis yra viena geriausių lygos komandų, labai džiaugias iškovojas šią pergalę, tačiau tai yra tik vienos rungtynės ir reikia nežvilti toliau. Coach, last time Juventus won against Letkabelis here in Panevežys, it was in 2019. After almost five years you won it here, it is a big thing for you as a team to end this series. Actually, I didn't know about this detail, but you know, I believe this is very important for the fans and for organization as Juventus is. I'm happy about this too. Like I said, not 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 to know before that, but you know we need to enjoy this. Class must be happy that Juventus has been able to pass the card to Milan after 2019 matches. And Koxiosmas is a no-trouk to back five matches. Trucks are not the most serious. Class must be happy that they are not going to be able to play with the best players in the world. They are the best players in the world. They are the best players in the world. 
I had a trainer talk about Sveikan organization. And for the last coach, uh, in one week, you're going to play against Ritas in a cup competition. 12 points, minus 12 points after the first game. Is it, uh, is it possible to achieve the final four? Um, person that I believe that like nothing is impossible. So, of course, they have big advantage. They played home, and of course, they have many reasons to have advantage in this game. But that's one game. If we play our best basketball, everything is possible. Viskas Imanova. Pasakins klausimas buvo apie po savaitės laukiančią atsakomą į dviko krausmę daugo taurėje, kurį Autenos komanda turi 12 taškų deficitą prieš Vilniaus į rytą. Ir klausimas buvo ar įmanoma dar patekti finalo ketvertą. Į ką treneris sakė, kad nieko nėra neįmanomo, jeigu tai yra tik vienas rungtynės, dabar jau, jeigu žaisim geriausią krepšinį, viskas yra įmanoma ir viską apibendrina lietuvių kalba.